The Built to Honor program is such a special program, honoring those that were selfless in serving us by serving them. Here at Pulte Group, we have many employees that are veterans or profoundly affected by the military. In the Washington, D.C. area, we serve military customers, those active in supporting the military, and those who have military family members. This is such an uplifting event for our employees and for us to serve and give back with what we do best. We are proud to be presenting this home to U.S. Army Sergeant Brian Edwards and his wife, Annabelle. He is a remarkable individual. He's a U.S. Army veteran. He is a Purple Heart recipient, and his strength, his will, and his determination have gotten him to where he is today. Thank you for your service and continuing to be an inspiration to us all. Annabelle, thank you for your service to our nation's military, for providing healing and hope and a very special gift to Brian and understanding. We thank you both very much for your service. We've been looking for a long time for a Built to Honor recipient, a family, for this home right here. And today, we believe we found it. So on behalf of Pulte Group, Operation Homefront, Elm Street Communities, the developer of this beautiful community, and the Built to Honor program, we'd like to welcome you to Watershed Community <laughs> in our Built to Honor home. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. This is insane. <laughs> we were like a loss for words. We were just expecting a bunch of interviews. <laughs> so we were what? not prepared for this beautiful welcoming. Thank yeah. you so much. We here at Pulte Group are excited to do what we do best to honor our nation's military. Here at the Watershed Community, we're right next door to the Fort Meade Military Base, which is the same branch of service that our veteran, Brian, served in. I served roughly four and a half years in the U.S. Army as a Ranger in 3rd Battalion. I met this beautiful woman along the way. <laughs> I haven't had like a forever home since I was like 12 years old when my mom and dad got divorced and um, I've just been moving constantly, even though, even in the military, like I went from barracks room to barracks room. So it's, having this is something that I didn't think was possible. I got emotional immediately because I was thinking like, finally something that he deserves so much that he's done. Like he gives constantly to like me and to our family and <laughs> I think I saw this and it was just such a beautiful um, display of like respect and honor and love. Uh, very excited for Brian and Annabelle and their future home here in our community. Uh, particularly this area of the county and this community in general has a really large component of military families and we think that they will be an excellent fit and find happiness here in the long run. Everything. Um, not, even, not just for us, but for generations to come. It will be a place where my whole family can lay their head. Mm -hmm.